The Hanging Gardens of Babylon are often described as having been a gorgeous garden containing a variety of shrubs and vines located on a mountain constructed of bricks. However, despite all these wonderful features, the Hanging Gardens of Babylon, one of the seven wonders of the ancient world, never actually existed. Firstly, there is actually no direct evidence that the gardens ever existed. In the following excerpt from the article called Seven Wonders of the Ancient World, it states, Though there are multiple accounts of the gardens in both Greek and Roman literature, none of them are firsthand and no mention of the gardens has been found in Babylonian cuneiform inscription. This indicates that all evidence for the gardens is derived from second-hand accounts which cannot be considered to be reliable sources. Additionally, King Nebuchadnezzar, who is said to have created the gardens, along with many other historical landmarks, does not have any writings about the gardens, although many documents survive regarding his other creations. According to the article entitled, Hanging Gardens of Babylon, many records exist of Nebuchadnezzar's works, yet his long and complete inscriptions do not mention any gardens. This lends further support to the idea that he did not in fact create the king gardens, and they may not have existed. Furthermore, there is no consensus regarding the location of the gardens. To the article entitled Journey to the Seven Wonders by Tony Peritet, much about the gardens is unknown, including their exact location. The hanging gardens by the very nature cannot be definitively found, says Richard A. Phillips. One example of these conflicting opinions is demonstrated in the text called Hanging Gardens of Babylon, as it states, Although an archaeological team surveyed the palace site and presented a reconstruction of the vaulted building as being the actual hanging gardens, accounts by Strabble place the hanging gardens at another location, near the Euphrates River. Taken together, these two quotes suggest that the location of the hanging gardens of Babylon has never been definitively established and Strong evidence in support of any one location is lacking. In conclusion, the Hanging Gardens of Babylon likely never existed, as the whereabouts of the gardens are unknown. There are no direct reports that they ever existed, and no evidence is available from the writings of the king attributed with the creation of the gardens. In fact, the Hanging Gardens of Babylon, while spectacular in the minds of many, may have simply been a description of an ideal garden.